Welcome to Virtual Cyber Range Demo. In this video, we will see a hands-on demonstration of using an exploit on a vulnerable application. At this time, there are over 200 plus challenges in the Virtual Cyber Range, and new scenarios are added every week. We will look at Shellshock, also known as Bashdoor, is a family of security bugs in the widely used Unix Bash shell, the first of which was disclosed on the 24th of September 2014. Many internet-facing services, such as some web server deployments, use Bash to process certain requests, allowing an attacker to cause vulnerable versions of Bash to execute arbitrary commands. This can allow an attacker to gain unauthorized access to a computer system. When you start the lab, a new instance is created for the vulnerable application, and you are given the attacker console to launch attacks on the target system. You can also access the vulnerable target system image and see the interface given. Let's Google for CV 2014 6271 and find an exploit for it, from one of the most popular resources, exploitdb.com. We will copy the link for the exploit and go back to our lab dashboard. Now let's access the attacker console and use wget to download our exploit. The usage is pretty straightforward. We use the URL of the target system in the exploit and read the file that contains our flag. We can test the exploit by sending an echo command. Echo command in Linux is used to display a line of text or string that are passed as an argument. This is a built-in command that is mostly used in shell scripts and batch files to output status text to the screen or a file. Then we can use the cat, or concatenate command, which is very frequently used in Linux. It reads data from the file and gives their content as output. In our case, we get the flag. Virtual labs simplify learning cybersecurity. We look forward to seeing you spend many productive hours and enhance your skills. Have a great day.